Welcome back to the Andila and Liam show. I'm Andila. I'm Andila. Yeah, that's Andila too. Um, this edition is going to be the end of season UNI TV awards. Liam, aren't you so excited? I'm so excited. Uh, last year, unfortunately, we have to be nice this semester. So, um, but yeah, we're nice. Last semester, I think we are a little bit too rude at some times, but you know, new year, new us, 2024. So we like to improve on us. Um, but yeah, we could kickstart whenever. Yeah, I mean, this year is all about improvements and changes. Ricky Dunkel, he's our best friend, but sometimes he can be a little bit of a stiff arm. Uh, so first award, do you want to introduce it? You got it, big bro. Uh, so first award is most likely to become a millionaire. Our nominees, myself, Andila Becker, um, Ricky Dunkel the uh, third, Mr. Evan Tremaine, and last but not least, Grayson Holt. Please don't be her. And it's Evan. Come on, Evan. Evan, take a seat for us. Mr. Tremaine. First of all, congratulations. I'm sure um, this award means so much to you. It does. I really appreciate the uh, offer and people voting for me to be the most likely to be a millionaire. I mean, I am going to be a millionaire, so no, uh, nothing wrong about that. So when you do become a millionaire, what's the first thing you're going to buy for me? For you? Um, how about a car? What kind of car do you want? A uh, Porsche uh, GT3 and nine, you know that one? You got it. You got it. Thanks. I like it in sage green, by the way, with uh, chrome wheels. Thanks. I'll get, I'll get you some chocolates, too, just to okay. chocolates. Oh, no! <laughs> wow, I see it. What do, you, what do you want? What do you want? What do I want? Yeah. I just want to find love. I don't know if you can buy that. <laughs> and, um, I, I don't know if I can. Find, uh, your ass. Uh, I don't know if I can find you that. I mean, I can probably buy. I can probably buy a woman. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can right, probably I, buy I someone think, for. Um, it. Thank you. Yeah, I think with that we're gonna move on to the next award. Congratulations, yeah. Evan. Yeah. Man, if he doesn't buy me that Porsche, I'm gonna be so mad. Yeah. All right, um, next award. All right, so that? yeah, so best director. This would fall usually a little bit later, but we got an Olympian in our room right now who's going to conference here in a little bit of a minute. So that gives you a little bit of a hint. Uh, best director award goes to uh, Kenna Machino. <laughs> Congratulations, Kenneth. Thank you. First of all, why do you have to leave us today? What's so important? to ride in the minivan seven hours to Kirksville, Missouri for a conference. So. And how are you going to do in conference? How are you feeling? I'm feeling pretty good, you know. I'm in for four events, so that's a lot. It's going to be kind of a marathon. But, uh, congrats. I mean, I saw a, a, a leaked video on uh, <laughs> of you doing some sort of throw. Can you explain what, what happened? Uh, yeah, that was which one? The one where I fell? Yep, yep, that one. Um, yeah, so my coach told me to go after it. And, you know, I went after and I was going really fast and I was not. So the ball's pulling you this way and you have to lean this way or you're going to fall over and that's what happened. Uh, so that's why I like to call skill issues so next time do better. Uh, All right, yeah. thank you, Kenna. Yep. Thank you. All right, you got it. All right, next award we have Most Humble. Nominees. Derek Jones. Unfortunately, Derek could not be with us. Rest in peace, Derek. He's still alive. Uh, next uh, nominee, Elijah Sutton. Sometimes he can be nice. Other times he looks at me funny. <laughs> uh, next, uh, we have uh, Aaron Rostrin. Enough said. Uh, then we have <laughs> Vanessa. So um, I'd like to congratulate Vanessa Pineda Sanchez. And Aaron. And Aaron. You can have this one, Aaron. <laughs> you won this just because, um, you know, your middle name's humble. I heard, um, so I heard Kendrick Lamar wrote a song for both of you. How do, how do you feel about that? No, you, so you really think it really you speak, you speak first. Okay. Oh my God, it's a good song. Good song? So uh, it's fantastic. So since you love the song Humble, uh, what's your favorite verse? And would I like you to recite it for No, me. I don't know. <laughs> Next question. Vanessa. Uh, congratulations. How do you thank feel? Thank you. Happy and humble. Happy. Amen. Uh, thank you, guys. Right. Thanks. Thank you. 
right, next up, we got the Up For Anything Award. Um, they're just a guy that just, or female, not to, uh, that, you know, wants to do anything, uh, pretty much just puts their mind to it and gets it done. Um, the people for Up For Anything Award are Charles, Jace, Aaron, and Elijah. Come on up, Jace. <laughs> Congratulations, my friend. Um, do I have to do this? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Man. I thought yeah. you're up for it. Yeah, so uh, you worked all seven games, correct? I did. How'd that feel? Tiring. Tiring? Yes. I did not sleep. Is your throat okay? Pause. Was, hey, hey, hey. Pause. <laughs> Pause. Yes, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It was, it was a long weekend, a lot of, a lot of, a lot of talking, but it's fine now. It's fine. Okay. Thank you. Uh, so next up uh, award is most likely to be a social media influencer. Um, I don't know why you'd want to influence people on the internet, so it seems a little weird to me. Um, but let's see, nominees, uh, Miss uh, Kennedy Phelps, uh, Kendall Pearson, we have Maddie Fisher, Ayo Barlow. Uh, any guesses on who it's going to be? Kendall. <laughs> well, uh, wrong. Kennedy, come up. Uh, when you're rich and famous, just shout me because, you know, oh, yeah? I got connections. Oh, my God. So what are you going to become uh, influential about? Uh, just, you know, live in life to the fullest. Live, laugh, love. Amen. Appreciate That's it. That's what I'm preaching. Aww. So, yeah. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, next award is most likely to get rich and never talk to anyone here ever again. Um, <laughs> Me, I'd be honored to win this, not gonna lie. No disrespect. Um, but um, yeah, so our nominees are Samuel, Gailey, Maddie, Adriana, uh, Madeline Fisher. Come on up. Oh, wow. So, uh, do you have <coughs> something against us? Is that why you never speak to us again? Be honest, we're, we're open Do conversation. Do I have something against, not you specifically, no. She's oh! <laughs> talking to the rest uh, of you guys, yeah. by the way. You know, so. No, way. it's just there are bigger and better things waiting for me, and I don't want to stay tied down to Indianapolis when there's a whole world to explore. I see it, I see it. Yeah. Good job, Maddie. Thank, Thank you. you. So this next award, um, it means a lot to me personally, uh, mainly because my dad's name is Life, and the award title is Life of the Party. Um, let's see, nominees. Uh, we have Ayo Bolo, uh, Kendall Pearson, Sam Gailey, Grayson Holt. Um, you know, this person is very close to me. Spent a, spent a lot of time with them freshman year. Uh, shout out 109, Samuel Gailey, come up here. Hey. Congratulations, my friend. Thank you. Uh, tell us, what's your go-to dance move at a rave? <clears throat> well, you know, you got to start off with the sketch. Then you got to do the check Tuesday. It depends on the, depends on the occasion. You know? And then you also you have your, your FIFA celebrations, too, from back in like 2015. Oh, yeah. Appreciate the award. It's going to go right on my wall, especially coming from you. So. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. All right, so this award goes to the best, best, best fashion sense here. Um, we got Naya, Nick, Elijah, and Adel. Um, I mean, it's all right. Come on up, Nick. <laughs> you got a no, 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 keep the bottle on. Keep it on. Keep it on. Keep it on. Keep it on. on. Keep it on. <laughs> All right, you know, there's a lot of things that um, go into fashion sense, you know, um, election, not election night, draft night, you were a little bit dripped out. What happened today? Why do you look so bad? <laughs> oh. Oh. I got tired after I woke up next to your mom. That's crazy. Yeah. <laughs> um, you know, I wanted to say uh, nice, nice hair, Thank you know, you. that's a good part of fashion sense. Mm -hmm. You got nice shoes. Thank you. Uh, I'm just going to keep it a buck. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. All right, good job. Yep. 
She got cussed on her mother. That's crazy. Wow. That crazy. That's disrespectful. Mm -hmm. All right, you. All right, uh, next up, we have someone a little bit better than Nick. Nicest person award. <laughs> um, our fellow nominees include uh, Kenna Machino. Uh, we got Derek Jones, rest in peace. V Vanessa and Charles. Uh, this person has always been very kind to me, unlike Nick. Um, Vanessa, would you like to receive your award? Aww. I've had the pleasure of sharing uh, the semester with you on Good Morning Greyhounds. Uh, so what's your favorite thing about me? <laughs> You're nice. Aww. Aww. You're really encouraging. Lead by example, thank you very much. Uh, anyway. Maybe. All right, yeah. Next award, best team player. This is just someone who, you know, you want on your team. Pick number one overall. Uh, <clears throat> Yay. Uh, but yeah, just someone you want on your team, someone who's just a good person, someone who helps out regardless of what they're doing and who they are. Uh, nominees, Jace, Evan Tremaine, uh, Aaron, and Adriana. Uh, this award goes to Adriana. You just wanna, you wanna stay there? You did? You just wanna stay there? Or you got it? Okay, you got it. We have a... Thanks. We are very, very grateful you can be here today. We uh, are. Congratulations yeah. on the award. You deserve it. the utmost out of everyone in this class, I think, so. Oh, thank congratulations. you. Congratulations. Yeah. Thank you. <clears throat> All right, next um, award is most likely to comfort you in a bad time. Um, I personally think maybe two people in this room can get that award, uh, but uh, the nominees, Ricky Dunkel. Uh, look at him smiling. <laughs> uh, Kennedy Phelps, Derek Jones, Maddie Fisher. Rest in peace, Derek, he would be here to receive the award, so. Um, you, wanna give it, you wanna give it to Derek? Oh yeah, here. I bet. All right. Um, Thank you. Derek Jones, everybody. All right. This one is a little bit, um, I don't know where I'm trying to go. Rising Star Recognition Award. Uh, just give someone a little bit of a spotlight of who has been on the, on the glow up, glow up, you know, rise up, whatever you want to say. Um, just give them some recognition for their good work and hard work they put in this semester. Um, Caden Colford, Dylan, Kendall, and Kennedy. Come on up, Dylan. I have seen your glow up firsthand. Oh, thank you so much. Um, I'd like to say congratulations firstly. Thank you. Uh, my favorite thing you've done this semester was your package in the woods. Oh yeah? Yep. <laughs> you like that? Yep. That's actually, good. I actually hated it. It was fun. Oh. <laughs> That's me. That's yeah, me. Uh, congratulations. Um, give, me, give me your favorite thing you've done this semester. Good morning, Greyhounds, with you. Amen. We're all me up. We're all me up. Good job, Dylan. Thank you. All right, next up, most likely to cover for you when you need them. Um, you know, we've struggled a little bit with uh, getting shifts done, you know, especially for sports. Um, shows has been a little bit better. I'd like to thank you guys for showing up to your, your shows. It's been great. Um, Kennedy, come on. Okay, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Rick. Cool. Oh, thank you. There you go. Um, so why do you like helping people? Because um, that's what life's all about. you got to help people when they need it. Mm. Yeah. Aww. Yeah. Love you guys. Love you. Thank you. Bye, guys. All right, so this award is completely undeserved, and I don't know who will vote for this ever in their life. Yeah. Um, this goes for the Class Clown Award. Uh, I, miss, I miss Graham and Colin, so yeah. Bye, guys. But I guess we have to stick with this guy. So Class Clown Award goes to Andile. Oh. You know, just, okay. Thanks. I was going to ask you to... I'm gonna ask you to tell a joke for everyone. Oh, I can, I can tell a joke. Right. Uh, 
Once upon a time, there was a young man. He walked into a bar, and then he said, ouch. Thanks. <laughs> And that's why it's well deserved. Um, next award, when you see them, you smile. Um, sometimes this could be because they look goofy. Um, sometimes it could be, thank God, it's not me. You know, thank God I'm, I'm me and I'm not them. No. Exactly. You know, yeah. um, there's many reasons why you can look at someone and smile, but I think this person actually deserves it. You know, they have a very uh, beautiful sculptured face. Oh, wow. Sorry, I'm just letting my inner bitch come out. Elijah, congratulations. We would have shared it with Derek again, but Derek, I'll be Derek. Um, we have a second winner. We have a second winner, but the winner, rest in peace, is still not here. You just, like, put it over there. Uh, the Derek, of, would yep. you? Rest in peace, Derek. <coughs> rest in peace, Derek. So is it true when people see you, they, they smile, they smirk, they, they, you know, look happy, you know? Um... I don't know, sometimes. I usually don't look at people, but like, I've been told like, <laughs> <laughs> truthfully, but um, I do notice that like, when I'm in the storm recently, that like, the old people like smile at me whenever I'm walking, so. That's cute. You know, if you really want to get smiles, you should go to China. <laughs> Thank you very much, Elijah. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> Next award, um, I think this one is, um, it's very obvious, we have uh, two winners, uh, three. 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 Three, three winners, um, so that means someone here didn't get it, that's tough Nick, uh, next time, so our winners, Liam Blaze, Ricky Dunkel and Kenny Colford. Just completely, you know. Mr. Steeler Girl himself. So, Rick, um, I'd like to start off with you. Congratulations. <laughs> um, keeping it, you know, within the walls of this room. I heard in Vegas you're seeing many girls. Is that true? <laughs> I just want to say that I could not be more proud to be up here with these two fellow winners. Uh, and we'll see how it goes next year. Kaden, um, you're actually a married man, so you actually don't steal uh, girls, you steal men. Is that true? You know what? I'm a gamer. I'm a gamer. Whatever that means, I come to play. I come to play. That's, that's what we like to see. Um, Liam, you said at the beginning that you want to find love. Mm -hmm. So what's this about? Why you? It's kind of crazy because I'm actually asexual. <laughs> so what that means is I'm not attracted to anybody. So oh. I think that's what that means. So, um, that's not what that means, but it is not what that means. It, 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 it may or may not be pretty much, you know, I just do me at the end of the day. If I flirt, I flirt, you know. But I'm, I'm grateful to share the podium with these gentlemen right, right here. Game is game. So, game, game is game. game. <laughs> game Alright, thank game. you guys. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, if I if I don't come to class next semester, you know Rick killed me. Um, next award is uh, most likely to be a WWE wrestler. That's a good award. Um, good award. I think. Yeah, I think judging by the reactions in the room, um, there's a clear winner. But let's read out the nominees nonetheless: Caden Colfield, Kenny Machino, Charles Foster, Evan Tremaine. Charles, would you like to get up on the screen? Don't hurt me, please. Um, so, who do you who do you model your WWE style after? Um, I'm gonna say Mark Henry. Um, just <laughs> <laughs> you know, um, I hear too. I got voted this because I'm I'm, I'm large, so I take it. What would be your wrestling name? It's a fantastic question. I do not know the answer to that. Okay. I think he should be called uh, Foster Child. <laughs> Because his last name is Foster. Yeah, just because the. All right, thanks, Charles. Yeah. <laughs> All right, next one. 
Next one is arrives first, leaves last. Whenever you go to production, he's gonna be there. Whenever you leave, he's still gonna be there. Um, Sometimes it's kind of annoying because, like, why, why won't you just leave? Yeah, I get a life at the end of the day. I mean, why thing. won't they just leave? Yeah. So it's me and DLA, Logan, and Rick. Uh, come on, exec. Logan! Congratulations, Mr. Wong. Thank you. Um, I just have a couple questions. Why do you linger? It's kind of annoying. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's mostly to make sure everything's organized. Mm. Tear, tear things down. Mm. Um, another question. Um, is there a reason, like, you try so hard? Like, are you trying to impress <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't know. I just make sure that um, things go smoothly for the next time and so we don't have to deal with... Uh, a mess, no, no, we, we really appreciate the help you do. do. Um, this summer, you're going to have a field day in the control room by Key Stadium. So yeah. we'll, see you, we'll see you around. Thank you. See you around. Thank you. Yeah. See you. Yeah, next award, um, most creative content creator. Is that what it says? Yep. Um, you know, there's a bit of a toss and turn with this one. Uh, Ashley Edison, you know, creator of great packages. Um, that we've seen this year. Uh, this weird guy in the second, I don't know who he is. Uh, Kenna Machino, she's all right. Uh, Evan Porterfield, um, I'd like to call up my fellow winner, Evan Porterfield. Where is that? Uh, you know, firstly, I'm thoroughly humbled to share this award with you. Uh, what's your favorite thing you've created this year? Grand Slam Sports TikToks. Those are awesome. Didn't you like win like uh, some international award or something for it? Yeah, we we won like an award. But, you know. Yeah, just a small time yeah, thing, you know. Gotcha. Yeah, gotcha. Yeah. Hey, speaking of, you have a job next year for Unity TV. Do you want to explain what that is? Yeah, post production producer. So. so I'll do all like the post of all of our shows, and then we're also going to be doing like secondary. So, TikToks and short form content. Very excited. Nice. Very excited. Thank, Thank you. you. Congratulations. Oh, okay. I want to dedicate this one to Liam Blaze. Thank you. That's cute. All right, next one is probably the greatest award to win here. Um, yeah. Most likely to be voted people's sexiest person alive. Yeah. Um, yeah, you know, they're just, they're just a charm. They're just... Your mouth just waters when you look at them. You just, you know, just, yeah. you just the, need them. The statue, when you look the at figure, them. the yeah. the aura, the aura. That's a good, yeah. All right, the aura. So our nominees are Grayson, myself, and Rick. Oh, he's already here. The man of the moment. Ricky Dunkel, uh, I'd like to say congratulations. Thank you. I think of all the awards, this one got it the most right. Yep, yep. Uh -huh. <laughs> all right, next award, um, the most slay award. Now, I don't know why we use this word slay, because once upon a time, it was used to a term for killing. Um, apparently, they're, they're killing the game. So, um, award nominees, we have Maddie Fisher, Grayson Holt, Kendall Pearson, and Naya Ortiz. I'd like to bring up the two winners, Grayson and Congratulations. Um, first of all, before you sit down, could you give me your most slay pose? Oh, yeah. So, yeah. so what does what does slay mean? Is that like an acronym? Like slay. stupidest slay. Well, something? Well, I like 88 times a day. I like to say about once a week. You're being a hater right now. <laughs> <laughs> um, I've been trying to win this award for three years, so that's really slay. That is so All right, get off. Get off. <laughs> my yeah, 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 get off. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Congratulations. All right, this one's a little bit more wholesome. Uh, most improved award. 
uh, every semester, you know, someone just shows maybe not necessarily starts off rock bottom, but you know, not as good as they can be. So later towards the semester, they show their fuller potential. Um, so our nominees are Aaron, Dylan, Sam, and Nick. Uh, come on up, Nick. You know, one thing I wish you would have improved is your kindness, but that's okay. Sorry. <laughs> nah, for real, uh, congratulations. We've seriously seen a lot of changes in you this semester. We're very proud. He was one of very few people to work all seven games for the Midwest Regional. Oh, yeah. So, you know. <laughs> Some of you guys. Aww. Aww. Thank you. Oh, 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 it's falling still. It's falling. It's falling. It's falling still. Oh my gosh. Just, the TV just got worse. Okay. All right. Um, next award is one that's dear to my soul. Um, best helper who is not a student manager. Um, you know, as you can see, we have Kendall Pearson, Maddie Fisher, Evan Porterfield, Dylan Euler. Um, this person has been a great help. You know, they're always showing up, doing the utmost to make everyone feel safe, comfortable, but also working better with, towards the productions of UNI TV. So I'd like to give this award to Evan Porterfield. <laughs> Thoroughly deserved. Um, so what does this promotion from best helper to uh, student manager next year mean to you? Um, it means that you thought I helped this semester. Wait till next year, guys. I'm going to be even more oh, yeah. Yeah. Congratulations. Um, look forward to working with you next year. Now yep. get off my screen. <laughs> All right, uh, this award, as you can read, most, re oh wait, you can't. Most reliable tech support, AKA Nathaniel Finch 2.0. Um, Before we get into it, who is this Nathaniel Finch guy? He's some mid dude who just did everything. Uh, he's not really, you know, he's oh, like he's an like, average guy. Five foot three, two. Yeah, yeah, probably as tall as Grayson, so like five one. Oh yeah, true. Um, oh, <laughs> <laughs> but the nominees are Logan, myself, and Kennedy. This one, obviously, you know who it is. Logan Wong. Um, Logan, I'm sure you'd love to know this, but you actually awarded 90% of the votes. <laughs> yep. Um, so. It's awesome. Yeah. <laughs> um, congratulations. Thank you. Who's your favorite tech YouTuber that you like to watch? My favorite, I, I pretty much just watch Linus. Linus? I don't, I don't branch out too much, but. So as you can tell, he's a computer geek. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Linus yep. Tech Tips. Yep. Yep. All right. So, um, Thank you. Congrats. Yep. All right. Oh, yes, you. So we got um, the next award, uh, most dedicated crew member. Um, as you can see, we have Adriana, Liam, Grayson, and Logan. Um, Logan's actually not very dedicated, so he's definitely not going to win this one. Um, but we have two winners, Grayson and Liam. So, um, do you agree with your winning of this award? No. So why are you up here? <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I'm really dedicated to the newscast, but there's a lot of other people in here that are way more dedicated to different crews. So what you're saying, you're honored to share the no, stage with me? No, I still you're got You're honored. It, so, uh, and the worst part is that I have to share with Liam. So, thank you. All right. Uh, Bye, guys. Love you. Okay, see ya. <laughs> Liam, uh, you know, I think you probably triple the amount of dedication Grayson has. I appreciate so, that. So, um, congratulations to you. Thanks. It's not a lot to, you know, Grayson doesn't. All right, never mind. Uh, best interviewer award. Uh, you know, just someone who could spark up a conversation, someone who could keep a conversation going, someone who makes good content with the interview. Um, so the nominees are Kendall, Dylan, and Derek. Uh, coming up, Kendall.
So we have seen firsthand um, your skill sets on Real Talk. Um, do you want to tell us uh, who you model yourself after? I honestly don't have a, um, like a... You're your own hero type of thing? Yeah, I'm my own hero. I don't look up to anybody. Oh, I, have, I set my own standard. Yeah, fair enough, fair enough. Um, I'd recommend looking up to Ricky Dunkel. But I just... He is okay. cool, but like... Fair. Oh, yeah. All right, thank All right, you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, is it me? Or yep. Like, oh, yep. Okay. Yep. Um, so this award uh, is for best <laughs> behind the scenes star award. Who made it that long? Um, our nominees this year, Nick. <laughs> <laughs> good one, Colford. That's a good one. I don't think you've ever heard that one, but uh, <laughs> Nick Gordon, Dylan, Kenna, and myself. Um, all right, thanks, guys. I win. Uh, you know, I heard um, behind the scenes is short for BTS, and my favorite uh, Korean pop group is BTS. So, congratulations, Andila. All right. Yeah. Uh, yeah, best student manager award. Um, you know, we got a good cast this whole this semester. Yeah. A lot of a lot of hard workers. Um, but yeah, nominees myself, Derek, and Kenna. I believe Aaron got robbed of this, me personally, but it goes to me. Um, okay, next one. Uh, we got most respected member of UNDTV. Great um, ball. Let's see, we got Liam Blaze, Ricky Dunkel, Logan Wong. Very, very tough competition in this group. Um, I think it's actually, um, it was pretty close. The votes are separated by one. I just made up that stat. Uh, the winner is Logan Wong. I think it's shown today that we'd actually disrespect Rick quite a lot. Um, <laughs> deserved we, we gave him the award that matters most. Sexiest, yeah, sexiest personal, life. personal yeah. life, apparently. Yeah. Uh, Logan, respected. Why do you think that is? Um, I don't know. It means a lot, guys. I appreciate it. Aww. Yeah. I would bow down on my knees for you, Paul. <laughs> uh, <laughs> congratulations. <laughs> All right. Best producer award uh, to someone who can make a show the best possible way with obviously help with other people. Uh, myself, Grayson, and Dile, and Logan. Um, it's, it's me with last call. Thanks, guys. Yeah. Seriously, I think um, last call has probably been the best show this year by a country mile. Um, so congratulations. Hey, how many news cards did you upload this year? Okay. Yeah, let's not. Be so real. Quite a few is like. Well, anyway, uh, okay. Congrats. Yeah, thanks. Pretty much. Yeah. All right, your turn. Um, best talent. You know, um, this this award goes to someone who speaks well. Uh, yeah. Is proud of themselves. Um, has done a great job with prep, and has really good hair. So uh, nominees: Caden, Jace, Naya, and Kendall. I'd like to give this award to Caden Cole. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank so, um, why do you feel it's so important to win Best Talent? What does this award mean to you? Well, I mean, you might remember last year, too. You might know a Drake song, Back to Back. That's, yeah. that's, yeah. that's what we're blaring today. That's, that's cool. what we're blaring today. Cool. Gotcha. All right. Like Drake, um, get off my stage. <laughs> okay. Okay, brother. <laughs> It. Let's see if you hit a three-peat next year. Um, yeah. All right, best friends award. You know, BFFs, they are the, um, the epitome, that's not the word, the pinnacle. Pretty much, <laughs> pretty much 
what the definition of best friends are are these two people. I always see them together, like even in the dining hall and such. Uh, catch me on my off days too. But uh, coming up, you too. Yep. <laughs> You know, a great thing about uh, these two winners is that they're literally peas in a pod. Is that the same? Two peas in a pod or something? Two peas in a pod. You know, during um, draft night, we uh, found them scavenging around in the radio studio uh, at like midnight when who knows what they're supposed to be doing. I was doing my air check for radio. Air check and PJs, by the way. Everyone take notes. Apparently, that's how you do it. Um, so why do you like each other? And also, before you say give me one thing you hate about each other. She goes to bed really early. Oh. Her work ethic. <laughs> <laughs> oh, all right. Um, okay, do you like each other at all, or just yeah, is this for a, show? Or? Yeah, we have a lot of similarities, like creepy ones, but it's all right. Um, yeah. Thanks, guys. Sweet. Yeah. 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 All right, this one. Um, is uh, mainly for our shows that we have. You know, we have a couple hosts, um, regular ones. This is best on-screen duo. Um, I think this is actually going to be best on-screen trio because there's a little version of them in the studio. Naya and Elijah, uh, yeah. congratulations. <laughs> so we. So uh, yeah, who's 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 that? You want to who's, who's that? Who's that little guy? Wait, can we interview? Oh, yeah. Yeah, we, um, we need a special guest. Name? Okay, this is Amor Lawson. He's not in the talky, goofy mood right now. Oh, okay. But, He's um, He is the reason why we are the best on screen duo, would you True. say? Truly, because, I don't know, we kind of hype ourselves up before the, before the studio, before yeah. we actually get in there. He's the true hype man of UNDTV, TV, and um, yeah, yeah. That's gotcha. It's, it's nice working with Nye. She helped me grow his talent. She helped me grow his talent and like Aww. actually have living and stuff on screen. That's oh, great. Yeah, be better. You guys have been great. Thank you so much. I've never co-anchored with someone like Elijah and it's really been the best thing. Hopefully, we see each other in the future and become Yo. co-anchors eventually. She's already famous, y'all. She's on screen already, so. <laughs> yeah. I got a couple commercials out there. If you see him, tag me. <laughs> All right, thank you guys. Congratulations thank you. again. Amor. Bye, Amor. Peace out, my guy. Bye. Okay, he just grabbed it. There you go. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. All right. Oh, there it is. All right, yeah. So, new to this year, we're going to have different uh, moments of the years. Um, so, we have. We have different nominees, as you guys can see. Um, but this year, <laughs> just wait, wait till next one. But uh, this year, we got last call with Mr. Pagel's class with the eighth graders. So, Caden and Jace. Wait, wait till they get the next one. First of all. Um, congratulations. Um, why, why, did, why was your best show with children? Pause. No, I'm not going to answer that. But no, we just like giving back. Mm. Because That's crazy. people invested into us, so we invest into the next generation. Me and, uh, me and Jace. Oh, gotcha. What do you say? Gotcha. Right. Thank you. All right, congrats. Thank you. All right, you got it this one. So this next award is actually the the one that matters the most, funniest moment on screen. Stay standing. Um, yep. I just like to recall uh, Kaden Coker. Um, size scares me. First of all, before you receive this, that's crazy. Um, do you wanna do you wanna give a little bit of context or no, or no context? Yeah, we got. We have to break this down. Why, like, why does? <laughs> so we gotta. Um, why does size scare you? What size scares you? <laughs> well, look. Last answer. It was a little easier to be politically correct. This one, 
<laughs> We've watered in some tricky territory here. Uh -huh. we, we were talking about a defensive lineman who was sitting about 6'1", 260, 270. That's He's a big dude. Be, yeah. um, That's a big, big, big guy. That's a big guy. Big, That's a big guy. Yep. That's a big guy. That's a big guy. Yeah, that guy is... Um, <laughs> Elijah's, uh, he's trying to walk me into this, um, this red zone, but, yeah, I, di I didn't know if he would, um... Can I ask what prompted you to say it three times in a row? <laughs> you know... You seem a little flustered. Is everything okay? I'm all right. I'm all right. Look, we all, we all have, we have our best moments, then we have our not-so-great moments. Uh -huh. I'm glad I'm getting this one out of the way. Gotcha. I hope in the, in the future, size will not scare you anymore. We're working on it. We're working on it. Thank you. <laughs> All right. And last but not least, we got best show. Overall, we all produce great shows through thick and through. I think that's how you say it. Uh, thick and thick. We can say that. Um, <laughs> But yeah, everyone did a good job in this room, so round of applause for everyone in here. But one specific show is better than everyone else, so screw you guys. Last call. Uh, our producer, Kenna, is also not here. But. So um, as I'm joined with three of the four core members of Last Call, um, I'd like to say congratulations. Um, what do you... There's a baby going crazy. <laughs> he knows too. <laughs> he knows too. What do you guys think um, makes Last Call so different and so special? And why are you guys so, better, so much better than everyone else? Chase, you could begin. Well, yeah. I think it helps when you know, me and Caden have been doing things together, sports games, sports shows together for almost two years now. I mean, the chemistry's there, right? It's always, always helps any show, right? Not you, know, you know. The chemistry's the there. Chemistry, like, like, you know, you know. Chemistry's there. Yes. I mean, I mean, you got chemistry all over the place, on the desk, in the control room, everywhere in between. So we're doing okay. So much chemistry, just all over. Just all it's over. Everywhere. It's everywhere. <laughs> gotcha. That's great. That's you great. <laughs> you can conclude. Um, I'd first of all I'd like to say congratulations everyone for this year. You guys have done great. Um, as we're scrolling through the awards for some reason, um, I'd like to say thank you for uh, coming to the Andelia and Liam show. Um, we'll be back sometime next year, next semester. We don't know when. Um, but uh, for now, thank you, Liam. Yeah, thank you. Uh, thank you to everyone in the studio. Thank you, everyone in the class. And, um, yeah. Till next time, Bye. see you guys.